Hello, I'm Nozomi from Earth Human Home. Today, I'd like to share you guys how to do Ikebana, Japanese flower arrangement. Um, there are a couple things you need to make Ikebana. First of all, beautiful flowers. Yes. And then, very sharp scissors. It's very important to have a nice sharp scissors to cut flowers because um, if you couldn't cut stems nice and sharp, it close the window, close the entrance, and water cannot go into through all the flowers. So have a nice sharp, very important things. Have a sharp knife, no scissors, very important. And next. Kenzon. Ta -da! This is uh, in English flower broth. I think it's very sharp and then um, very, very beautiful. We carry this, all of this, made in Japan. So you use tea and then a uh, container to put your flowers. Today we pick this beautiful made in Japan glass. See through guys. Very simple, cheap. And then you need water in, in a bowl or whatever. You need a tons of water. The reasons why we need some water is because we will cut flowers inside of the water. It's very, very important to cut um, stems, flowers inside of water because if you cut not inside of water. First thing that comes through the stem is air. And after that, you put the flower into the water. You need a lot of uh, force and pressure to push the air out and then water after water come in. But if you cut flowers inside of water, first thing coming into the stems are, guess what? Water. Mm, that's what we want. So I highly recommend to prepare water in the bowl. Okay. And since Ikebana has over 500 years of history and there are tons of different methods, but today I'd like to show you guys, I call it sailboat methods. So, um, sailboat has boat, mass, and here two sails. So think about Kenzan, your container has a boat and I want you guys to make, we are going to make mast and two sails. Okay, sounds good? Yeah, really. Let's get started. So first things, you need to have a nice strong backbone, right? So let's find what would be the best for the mast. Usually something tall and strong one. So let's see. How about these guys? They're pretty and important. Cut inside of water. Okay. And then let's do another one too. Okay. And then inside of water. This is beautiful. Susu, susu no ki, susu no ha. How do you say this in English? Please leave the comment. How do you call this in English? Thank you. Very proud. Okay, next we want, let's do big sail. So big sail is something not tall like a mass but tall enough and have a good volume so i'm gonna pick this one okay this is a very very light and gentle one so let's see i'm gonna cut them inside of water mm, it's very sharp very nice punish Mast and sail. 
pixel. Now I want to make another cell. Okay. Oopsies. Come on. Also, um, in LA, because of all the what's going on right now. Flower markets are closed, so we went to um, hiking and got all oh, those beautiful wild flowers. Thank you, Mother of Nature. And then, it smells so good. Okay, now we are going to make teeny tiny sail. Something really short but has a nice big, I think the biggest volume comes in the front, which is oh, this one. It's pretty, no? It doesn't smell, it's pretty. Okay, now cut it. Teeny size of water. Ooh, this is thick, but this scissors, very, very easy to cut. Let's see. There we go. Okay, so let's take a look what we got here. Ta -da! We got coat, mask, nice long mask, and longer beautiful sail in this side, and short but smaller nice another sail in this side. Ta -da! Very easy and fun. But this is again, this is just um guideline, so you can make any way you want to. It's like a showing what is beautiful for you. Show your perspective of the beauty of nature. And have fun! Okay? Um, please subscribe us if you guys like the video. Um, and if you guys have any requests or um, any questions, please let us know. And Thank you so much. Oh, don't forget, put this one into your container. Let's put some water for kids. The water. Can I do this? Okay, I'm gonna cheat because I don't wanna. There you go. Water. You want to put the water um, above the canzan, okay? But not too much because we don't want. You don't want um, leaves to inside of water or the stems. Okay? Oh. And then, oh, another important thing those are very nice, sharp scissors, but always make sure it's nice and dry after use. Okay? Oh, because if I didn't, <laughs> because you know, it will stain. It will stain because it, it will it will not stain. How do you say it will rust? English <laughs> it will rust. Um like have you ever watched a like a Japanese samurai movie? Like after they use a the sword, they clean up and put it back. Otherwise it will you cannot use it again. Same thing. Please nice and dry, make sure. Okay. I think finally I hope you guys like it. Have a nice day and stay safe and healthy. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Thank you.